Hi, Dr. Tree. This is an interesting room. Hi, welcome to the Human Factors and Safety Lab. What's special about this program? It's the only Human Factors degree program in Singapore. What's the top three highlights of this program? Mm, you get to learn a lot about people. You get to visit very, very interesting places like Jurong Island. And you get to come into this lab and play with all our toys. Cool. What's the most interesting module and why? Um, the course that I teach is about how our minds work. And after the course, you can go back and uh, explain to your spouse scientifically why you forgot to buy the eggs. <laughs> What's the most challenging part of this course? Um, you've got to like people. You've got to like learning about people. After all, it is a program about the human factors. Name one famous person with a degree similar to this. Um, Steve Jobs, he was all about user-centered design, degree or no degree. Who would apply for this program? Um, if you're interested in uh, design, if you're interested in safety, if you are interested in um, designing for safety, then come and uh, take our program. Uh, sounds like me. How are le lessons conducted? Um, it's a mixture of online and face-to-face -face lessons. How flexible are class time? Very, very flexible. Um, we don't take attendance in classes, you know. After all, you're all adults. Name three jobs graduates can look forward to. Workplace safety and health professionals, um, human factors uh, specialists, and of course, you can also move into uh, user experience design or interaction design. How long does it take to complete this program? Um, you can do it in three years if you want to, but you are given eight years to complete the program. How much can graduates earn? Actually, safety professionals are known to make pretty good money and uh, human factors specialists are very, very rare in Singapore. So, expect to be very, very sought after. What are the admissions requirements? Um, I believe they're online, so you might want to go and check it out. Uh, recall a funny incident during class. Oh, that would be when my classroom experiment went south. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> if this program were a song, what would the title be? Human by the Killers. Nice. When and where can they apply? Um, again, I believe uh, you can actually go online and submit an e-application. If you were stranded on an island and you can only take one book, what would it be? Um, the Bible. It's my compass. What's your favourite food on campus? Uh, tom yum dumplings. <laughs> yum. Oh, I like that too. <laughs> can you say make your mark for the greater good in the best accent? Um, I'm not very good with accent, so I have to say in the Chu Yun Peng accent. Make your mark for the greater good. Okay, one last bonus question. Can you name me the SAS values? Wow. Hmm. Spirit. So, spirit of learning, uh, passion for community, integrity, respect and trust, innovation and teamwork. Yay, you got it. Thank you, Dr. Chi, for your time. Sure. Bye. Bye.